Hello, my old school soul food family. Chef Jeffy back with another video. All right, y'all. This is TGI Fish Segment of the Week, Friday morning for y'all, Thursday afternoon, Thursday night for me. And I'm in the mood for some fish sandwich, y'all. You know the old school catfish sandwich you used to get in the cafe? And my mama say the cafe, we say restaurant, or uh, I guess restaurant, but she say cafe. But that's what I'm going to make here, y'all. I was in the mood for that. So I'm just getting stuff situated here. I got some fish fry here. I'm going to go on and pour in here. Y'all know my Louisiana fish fry right here. I'm going to go and get that and get that on out of the way. So all I'm doing, y'all, I'm doing the easy way. I even got tartar sauce. I already pre-made tartar sauce. I want me a quick catfish sandwich. I'm going to put lettuce, tomatoes, and tartar sauce on the toasted bun. I'm going to fry the catfish off. Very simple, very easy, y'all. Let me move my lettuce. See my lettuce and tomatoes I got right here? Shredded lettuce. I sliced tomatoes very, very thin. I'm going to move them to the side. I got my grease heating up. In fact, I'm going to heat it back up. I had it heating up. I'm going to turn it off. I got some grease heating up. I got my buns here. Matter of fact, I'm going to open them up. Regular Texas size sesame seed buns here. It's just me and my friend here, so that's all that we got to make a couple of these. I'm going to put some bun on these buns here. And y'all know how I like to toast the bun in the skillet with the butter. So I'm going to go on and do this while the, while the uh, oil is heating up. Put the butter in there, and I'm going to toast that butter on the bun, y'all. And this is going to be good. And it won't give me inspiration for this. Of course, it's Lenten season. I'm going to try to make sure I get a fish product every Friday for y'all. The people that don't eat meat on Fridays. The Catholic people. So I, in the Lent season for Easter. And also, I see Popeye's got a fried flounder sandwich. And I saw it on TV the other night. I said, hmm, I got something better than Popeye's flounder sandwich. I'm going to give me a fried catfish sandwich. So, that's definitely what I'm going to do today. So, Anyway, y'all, I'm going to step on and be right back. Once my oil heat up, we're going to fry this fish off, put it on the sheet pan, let it uh, drain, get my buns heated up. We're going to put this sandwich together so, so quickly. So anyway, y'all, we'll be right back. TGIF fish segment of the week, just getting started. Be right back. Okay, y'all, we are back here. Okay, my oil is heating up here. Now I'm going to season my fish here a little bit. Put my shake there and my cavernous. Get that season there. Put my hands off here. I just got some regular catfish nuggets here, y'all. Y'all know I do my fresh catfish. Y'all know that. I don't have no uh, milk, no nothing, y'all. Just using the moisture from the frozen catfish. Using the moisture from that. Okay, I'm gonna put my fish in my in my little breading here. Move y'all over here. Let me move y'all over here so y'all can see what's about to happen here. Y'all don't miss no action here. It's just really, really, everything really, really breaded up here, y'all. Make sure all that breading's on that good, y'all. That's the key. And make sure it's really breaded good. If it's not, it's not gonna work. Here. Hold on, y'all. We'll be right back. All right, y'all. We back. Sorry about that. A little technical difficulties there. Uh, with my camera here. Okay. I got the fish here in the fry in my grease here. That fish. I'm doing it in two batches here. I don't want to put too many at one time. As you know. You put too much catfish at one time, it'll uh, make the oil go down, the temperature of the oil go down. So I'll fry this about, about two to three minutes. You know it don't take long on fish to cook. Y'all know that already. Y'all been watching me enough. It don't take long at all for fish to get done. It's nice catfish, fresh catfish. Y'all know I catch my own Pretty much catch my own fish here. 
Get this over here. Get it on the other side there. Oil, good hot oil is very important. You have hot oil, y'all. This one over here. This one over. That one over. Yeah. Looking good. Looking good there. Perfect for perfect for catfish sandwich, y'all. Perfect catfish for sandwiches. So we're gonna let this cook about two to three minutes. We'll be back when I get the other ones in, and we're gonna put this sandwich together. We'll be right back. Okay, y'all, we are back. I'm sorry about that, y'all. My catfish is ready. You see it right here. I just took it off. See the nice, uh, pretty catfish there? Now, what I'm going to do here, we're going to put our buns in this skillet here. Y'all know this is my bun skillet. So I do my hamburger buns and put that butt in there, y'all. And we're going to assemble these, uh, we're going to get these sandwiches assembled here. I'm going to put my catfish over here to the front. I'm going to get my tartar sauce and my lettuce and tomatoes. And we're going to make us a uh, wax paper here. Nice, quick, easy sandwich here, y'all. Nice, quick, easy sandwich. Love, I, you know I love my... Love my buns toasted, y'all. Y'all already know that about me. I do not like cold hamburger buns on anything, any sandwich. Flip that over there. And then I'm gonna flip it back over one more time. Let it get completely toasted. Like that. Takes about one minute here. Nothing like a good catfish sandwich, y'all. Put a little catfish nuggets there. Lettuce and tomatoes, tartar sauce. You can put some pickles on it if you want, but I'm just regular simply put onions on it. That's it, we're gonna turn that off. We're gonna move y'all over here to the assembly station. See, I got my catfish there already. Lettuce and tomatoes there. We're going to put this thing together, y'all. Very simple. Got my buns there. I got tartar sauce. Like I said, I'm being lazy. I just bought some tartar sauce out of the, out of the bottle here. Of course, you know tartar sauce is simple to make, too. Spread that on the bottom there. Put the shredded lettuce there. Then little like diced tomatoes. I'm gonna put all of them on there, y'all. Put every one of them on there. Lay my catfish on there. Try to do it as small as possible, y'all. If I get one more on there, there we go. Do this in the same way. Put that one on there. Oh yeah, this is gonna be a big catfish sandwich here, y'all. Get my top bun. Come on there, come on there. There we go. Y'all with me here? Y'all with me on this? Throw that on there. Y'all probably say, now how are you gonna eat this sandwich? We'll show you the old school way like we do it in the cafe. Gotta wrap this thing, that's the only way you can eat it, y'all. Wrap it like that. Throw that toothpick on there, like that. Grab my, grab my plate there. Get my other one here. Put that wax paper on there. I always keep wax paper, y'all. Get that on there, throw that toothpick on here. Voila, look at that. Kevin, that don't look like some good old catfish eating. So I'm going to clean up. I'm going to do that famous YouTube thumbnail, y'all. And we're going to be back. And we're going to try this old school catfish sandwich out. We'll be right back. Okay, y'all. We are back here. And check this out, y'all. Check out this sandwich here, y'all. Look at that. Look at them sandwich. 
Okay, I'm gonna dig into this one right here, move this one over. Got that little piece there trying to fall. Look at that nice catfish trying to fall off. Mm. Mm. Look at that, y'all. We some good eating. Move that toothpick back. And dive in there. All right, y'all. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Crispy, moist. Look at that. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Another bite. Another bite, y'all. Mmm, mmm, mmm. Good eating. Good eating there, y'all. That fish sandwich? Hmm. One more bite. Then I'll close the video. Hmm. Wow. That's what I'm talking about. Like stay in the country, that dog a hunt. But anyway, little short video. Show y'all how to. If you only meet on Friday, eat your catfish sandwich right there. Look at that. Let me close the video while I can finish this sandwich out. So if you like this video. Please share, please comment, please subscribe, please follow my other social media accounts, Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, <clears throat> Twitter, Twitch TV, Pinterest, and oldschoolsoulfood.com. Remember the hashtag 2022, helping others with a purple old school soul food. Until next time, have a blessed old school soul food day, and I will see y'all in the next video. Y'all have a happy weekend and a blessed fire. Love y'all. Bye.